caught on camera pushing her former friend off a bridge was led away in handcuffs today, taken to jail for several days. Sentencing happened earlier this afternoon in Clark County. Our Jennifer Dowling is live outside the courthouse now with the very latest on this case that we've been following for quite a while, Jen. We have, and it was an emotional day in court for both of the girls. Taylor Smith, the teen accused of pushing her own friend off of the bridge, injuring her, was taken away in tears. Taylor Smith cried as she put her hands behind her back and was cuffed by Clark County deputies, then led away to jail. The sentencing followed a tearful apology to her former friend Jordan Holgerson, the 16 year old. She pushed 60 feet off the Molten Falls Bridge. That video went viral. And I just sincerely apologize to Jordan Holgerson, and her family and friends for the pain and humiliation I had caused. Smith pleaded guilty to one count of reckless endangerment last week. Jordan, who suffered broken ribs and a collapsed lung, sat quietly looking on. I think it's probably just as emotional for her as, as me, but. I don't know. Was it a relief to see her cuffed and, and taken into uh, custody? Mm, I didn't really watch. In addition to two days in jail, Smith also received 38 days of community service on a work crew. Under the Clark County prosecutor's recommended sentencing, she didn't necessarily have to go to jail, but the judge decided to send her, citing the seriousness of the case. This is the, the most reckless, reckless amazement you've ever are sincere. I can't say I don't deserve the hate from the media or the loss of old friends, but what I can say is that I have and will continue to try my best to right my wrongs. Jordan's shoulder is still recovering. She's going to therapy and still has anxiety. She says she's playing softball, though, and trying to get life back on track. How's your healing going? It's going good. I think she's pretty shooken up right now, but we are happy that the judge imposed what he did, and we're happy that it's over. The judge also ordered Smith not to have contact with Jordan for at least two years. Back to you.